And a good evening, everybody out there in the Chattahoochee Valley. Welcome to another exciting event on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. We have got CVCC region basketball play, and we have got a big one tonight because the Pirates of CVCC are taking on the Lions of Reed State. This is a Division II matchup as CVCC comes in with a 13-6 and overall record, 4-2 and in the division, and Reed State is right there in fifth place with a 2-3 and record in the division, 5-10 and overall. And CVCC is trying to bounce back after a loss to Sneed State, who's still undefeated in the region. As here are your starting lineup, starting with the visiting Lions, you have Tyler Mallory, the leading scorer on the team, Tristan Watson, TJ Wiggins, Nalon Kidd, and Gerald Tillman. For the Pirates, you have Omari Hamilton, London Williams, Micah Hoover, Elijah March, and Tim James Jr. As they get set to tip it off, the CVCC Pirates are led by their head coach, Douglas Bird. And you are watching CVCC Pirates Basketball on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Getting ready to tip it off for the Pirates is Micah Hoover. And the leading scorer for the Pirates is Omari Hamilton. He's actually second in the entire Alabama Community College Conference in points. He averages... 21.5 points a game as they're trying to set the scores clock. And the, we'll get ready to go here for some junior college basketball. It's, this is a very nice gym, and you can see the banners just across from where we are up in the bleachers. And uh, they have a lot of NJCAA championships that are displayed, just an outstanding program led by the leadership of athletic director Ben Hicks. And uh, it was last week Robert Edmonds had the call on Georgia Alabama Sports Live where they suffered a heartbreaker to Sneed State. The Pirates and Lady Pirates were in action as uh, the Pirates win the tip, and there it is, London Williams, also known as the boss man, over to Colonel Marsh. Back over to Williams. Far side, Williams trying to drive the lane. It's going to stay right here with the Pirates. That was good defense by number 24, Tristan Watson. Inbounding it. There's a bounce pass right over to Hamilton. Hamilton, quick double team. Colonel Marsh thought about the three, driving the lane, puts up a shot. Oh, and it got blocked got blocked by Wiggins here comes Mallory he's the leading scorer for the Lions and we do have a delay because they did not reset the shot clock so Reed State they are out of Evergreen Alabama if you wondering where that is that's just about 30 minutes north of Prattville this is a huge Alabama Community College Conference game between two teams, and the Pirates trying to snap a two-game losing streak. But that was a game where they were down big to Sneed State, and uh, they came back and almost won it. As inbounding the ball is going to be Nalon Kidd. Top of the key to Tillman. Back over to Kidd. Swinging it around to Watson. Kid now with it. Mallory being guarded right by James. Mallory for three. No good. And two players trying to go up for the rebound. It, it's deflected off the Pirates. Hamilton, and it's going to stay right here with the Lions. Mallory over to Tillman. Watson fires a three, no good, and that's going to be rebounded by Hoover. Micah Hoover takes it, Colonel Marsh. We're going to get another whistle here with 18.56 left to go here in the first quarter. We are underway here on the campus of Chattahoochee Valley Community College 
here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. We're going to go ahead and take a break. It's scoreless here at CVCC, taking on Reed State here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Welcome back to the campus of CVCC here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Had a little bit of a delay, but we're back at it as Colonel Marsh over to Hamilton driving the lane. Hamilton, little spin, bounce pass to the boss man. No good. That's going to be rebounded by Wiggins. Wiggins trying to get by Hamilton, almost lost the handles. Nice move, Mallory. Back out to Kid. Mallory, top of the key. Tillman was trying to set up a screen. Wiggins, baseline, Kid. Shot clock winding down. Mallory for 
Mallory puts up a shot off the glass and in. Reed State with a 2-0 lead over the Pirates. Here comes Marsh. Taking it across the timeline. Elijah Marsh, also known as Colonel Marsh. I, I like these nicknames that Robert Edmonds has given. I, I called a game with Robert Edmonds and very creative nicknames. James. Oh, what a move. As Hamilton all the way to the rack ties his game at two. Good job by Amari Hamilton. There's a three-pointer. No good by Kidd. That's going to be rebounded by Marsh. CVCC likes to go fast. Hamilton dribbles. Being guarded by Mallory. Lost the handles, but it's off a Lions player. It's going to stay here with the Pirates. Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Richard Holdridge here on the campus of CVCC. Nice bounce pass. No good. That was James with the shot. Might have forced something up. Driving the lane is Watson. Kicks it back out to Kidd. Mallory. Quick double team. Tailman. Almost got it blocked. Almost lost it for a second. Mallory swinging it over to Wiggins. Shot clock at 10. There's a screen. Wiggins. They got to get a shot off, and he does. That is Mallory with a forced shot. He still had some time to maybe not force that one. Hamilton over to Marsh. Inside to Hoover. Nice give and go to the lane. And Amari Hamilton gets fouled. That actually will be a charge. They're going to call that foul on Amari Hamilton. 16-35. Here to go. 2-2 two to two is your score. Here on George Alabama Sports Live, CVCC Hoops. Swinging it around. Pirates are in the man. Marsh guarded Wiggins. Oh, there's a turnover. That's a good job. James wants to hurry up and go fast. Oh, nice pass to Hamilton inside. Hamilton's got four points, and the Pirates leading four to two. There's Watson being guarded by Hamilton. Watson, no good. Rebounded by Marsh. Here comes Colonel Marsh. Marsh is just going to go coast to coast. But that was just a bad angle on the shot. But the refs is going to call a foul anyway on the Lions. The Lions out of Reed State, Evergreen, Alabama. Just looking at the standings. So far in Division II in the Alabama Community College Conference. Right now, as Marsh misses the first. Right now, the Pirates are in second place with a 4-2 and two record. And Reed State is in fifth place with a 2-3 and three record. So this is a big game for both teams. As Colonel Marsh makes one of two, it is five to two. Wiggins, there's a three-pointer by Kidd. No good. He gets his own rebound. Kidd is just going to drive all the way. Contested shot by the boss man, and he gets a big, giant rebound. And here comes CVCC on a 5-0 run. Hamilton back out to James, far side. Williams, nice fadeaway jumper. That's going to be rebounded by Kidd. Five to two is your score. Mallory takes it atop the key. Over to Watson. Driving the lane is Kidd all the way to the rack and in. Good move by Kidd. Nalon Kidd, who averages 9.9 .9 points a game for the Lions. Bounce pass, London Williams. Three-pointer for James. No good, but trying to save it is Micah Hoover. It's going to go back to the Lions. So perhaps Reed State can try to get some momentum. It's been a back-and-forth game, but 
that long delay kind of broke a little bit of their rhythm, but it, it was scoreless in that game. And just trying to get back into to playing. It, it gave the players a little bit of a breather as Mallory thought about driving the lane. He bounced, passes it over to Kidd. Three-pointer by Watson. No good. It's going to be rebounded by Hoover. Hoover's going to pass it over to Colonel Marsh. Marsh is just going to drive all the way. Euro step. Foul before the shot. Are they going to call it on the floor? Yes, they will. The shot will not count. It'll be a non-shooting foul. And Elijah Marsh will take it inbounds. Elijah Marsh averaging 9.3 points a game. Also second on the team, third on the team in steals. Swing it around. London Williams. Back out to James, top of the key. James driving the lane. Spin move, fadeaway jumper. Nothing but the bottom of the net. What a shot. Tim James Jr. It's 7-4. Pirates on top. Mallory, oh, nice pass to Wiggins, and that's up and in. Good court vision by Mallory to see Wiggins at 7-6. Marsh over to James. Pass to Williams, far side, being guarded by Wiggins. Bounce pass, Micah Hoover, James, fadeaway jumper, too short. Off the front of the iron, and here comes Mallory with a chance for the Lions to take the lead. Oh, and what a steal by Colonel Marsh. Marsh all the way with the jam. Elijah Marsh gets these big teammates and this crowd fired up. It's a 9-6 lead. Wiggins for three. He makes it and it ties the game. We are knotted up at nine apiece here in the first half. Live at the campus of Chattahoochee Valley Community College in Phoenix City, Alabama. London Williams, a nice fake, but it looked like they're going to call a foul. It was a good fake by London Williams. He, in 17 games this year, averaging 13.4 points a game. Timeout on the floor. We would like to thank our sponsors, Superior Roofing. Rocket Stone, LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour, Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Behringer Construction, Pacelli, p and Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and Double Coverage. 12.31 left to go in the half. We are knotted up at 9. We'll be back here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Welcome back to CVCC, Georgia Alabama Sports Live, Richard Holdridge, Toygar. Just keeping it down here as the Pirates taking on the Lions in a huge division matchup in the Alabama Community College Conference. As the Pirates trying to snap a two-game losing streak. There's Colonel Marsh for three. No good. There's a nice rebound by Wiggins. Mallory, Lawless lost his handles and then puts up a shot, rattles in and out. Rebounded by Hoover. Here comes Colonel Marsh, little pass to the boss man. It's going to stay right here with the Pirates. I really like London Williams' game. He's a great post player. He can also shoot. And 
Oh, that was just a costly turnover. Wiggins is going to go all the way to the rack up and in. It's an 11-9 lead for Reed State. They did lead 2-0 to start this game. They retake the lead. Here comes Tim James. Colonel Marsh, bounce pass to James, baseline. Looking for a teammate, got the double team. Nice pass to Marsh. Marsh got to kick it out to London Williams for the shot. First two points of the game for the boss man. It's tied again at 11. Here comes Tyler Mallory, leading scorer with 19.4 points a game. He fires a long NBA range three, no good. And there's Amari Hamilton all the way to the rack to Micah Hoover. Good pass by Hamilton all the way to Hoover. And the Pirates retake the lead. There's a shot, four shot by Mallory, trying to fight for the rebound. There's the boss man getting a big rebound. London Williams taking it across the timeline, gives it over to Tim James, bounce pass to Hoover. Hoover is going to reset it. Nice screen by Williams. Williams is going to fire three. It's up and in. London Williams, also known as the boss man, gives CVCC their largest lead of the game. 16 to 11. As CVCC 4 and 2 in the division. Reed State 2 and 3. Oh, and that's going to stay right here with the Lions. That's going to be a foul. They're going to call that foul on number 21, Micah Hoover. That's going to be a shooting foul. That's going to put Wiggins to the line, T.J. Wiggins, who is averaging 11.9 points a game. And yeah, Wiggins makes the first. So Sneed State undefeated in this division with a 14-5 overall record, 6-0 in the division. They were able to defeat CVCC last week. It was a very close game. They jumped out to that big lead. Wiggins misses the second. It's a four-point lead for the Pirates. Williams, bounce pass, Hamilton. Amari Hamilton, one of the top scorers in the Alabama Community College Conference. Almost got it stolen by Mallory, but it's going to stay right here with the Pirates. Don't forget the next CVCC game. The Lady Pirates are going to be in action against Lawson State next Tuesday. Actually, no, Thursday they're taking on Talladega. They were supposed to play Lawson State last Tuesday, but it did get postponed. It looks like both teams will be in action on the 25th as they will both take on Loreen B. Wallace Community College. As the season is uh, starting to wind down. Got about a month left in the regular season before we go into postseason play. Oh, Tim James, strong move, just not enough. And that's a turnover on the Lions, a double dribble back to the Pirates with a four-point lead. This team... CVCC, one of the top teams in all the nation when it comes to the junior college level. Multiple NC, NJCAA championships. London Williams being guarded by Tillman. Sweetens it over. Five on the shot clock. Tim James, fadeaway jumper, no good. It's going to be rebounded by Tillman. Here comes Mallory. Three-pointer by Kidd, no good. Williams comes up with a rebound. And Amari Wilcher checks into the game for the Pirates. Wilcher fires a shot. And a good job with the putback. By number 12, Amari Hamilton. Nice bounce pass and loses the handles. It's going to go back to the Pirates. So right now the leading scorers for the Pirates, Amari Hamilton with six points, London Williams with five. For Reed State.
There's a three-pointer. No good. Nice offensive rebound. London Williams for three. No good. But right there to clean up the glass is Amari Hamilton, who's got eight points. Reed State did not box him out, and Reed State travels. It's going to be a traveling violation on Mallory. Please like the Facebook page. Subscribe to the YouTube channel, Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Uh, we got some high school basketball action coming up this weekend. Oh, nice pass, but it was anticipated by Wiggins. It just tips it out. As Thrip Barrage and I will be at that school on the hill tomorrow as they will take on the Golden Tornadoes of Monroe. Oh, nice pass to the boss man, just a little too short. And Wiggins, Watson comes up with a rebound. Mallory resetting the offense, swinging around to Wiggins. Oh, a nice bounce pass to Tillman. Wide open for three and hits it. And Reed State has cut this Pirates lead to five with 7.52 left to go in the first half. Back out to Wiltshire. Marsh. Amari Hamilton. Colonel Marsh. Dribbling. Driving the lane. Over to Williams. Hamilton splits the defenders, puts up a wild shot, and did not get the foul call. And Kidd comes up with the rebound over to Wiggins. Mallory back to Wiggins. Oh, behind the back. Tillman. Three-pointer by Watson, and he hits his second three of the game. And it's a two-point lead for the Pirates. Lines on a little bit of a run here with 7.04 left to go here in the first half. Wiltshire over to Hamilton, back over to Colonel Marsh. Marsh passes to Wiltshire for three, and he answers with a three of his own. And it's back to a five-point lead for the Pirates. Oh, there's Tillman. Oh, that got blocked, and there's a missed dunk by Watson. But they get it back. Mallory shoots a three, air mails it. A nice save by Watson. Trying to avoid a backcourt violation is Wiggins. Still with it. Tillman driving. Passes over to Watson for three and hits it. Well, Watson, he's got three threes in this game. And he answers once again, and the Pirates lead by two. Watson is the leading scorer with nine points for Reed State. Here comes Wiltshire. Oh, and that is stolen. Good anticipation by Wiggins. All the way and ties it. 23 all here with 5.51 left to go here in the first half. Wiltshire back over to Marsh. Hamilton almost lost it. That's going to be a foul. Five forty-two left to go here in the first half. As we will have a timeout here on the campus of CVCC. We'll be back. Five forty-two left to go here on George Alabama Sports Live. We are back here on the campus of CVCC, Georgia Alabama Sports Live, Richard Holdridge, Toygar Isla. Happy to be here on this Thursday night. 
Don't forget, tomorrow we're going to be at Carver for Carver Monroe. And then on Saturday, we got Shaw at Harris County. Here we go, Wilcher with it. Knotted up at 23 apiece. Marsh. Nice pass, and that shot is good by number two, Andrew McKind. As Coach Bird is going to his bench. The Pirates with a two-point lead. Oh, the handles. Tillman, nice pass. And that is going to be, are they going to call an offensive foul? That's got to be an offensive foul on Jadavian Robinson, but they're calling it a shooting foul on the Pirates, and Jadavian Robinson is going to go to the line for two. Oh, and one. Actually, he did make that. So he will go to the line for the and one. And Robinson makes it. It's a one-point lead for the Lions. They have climbed all the way back in this game. The Pirates had a six-point lead, and then the Lions were able to come back. James behind the arc, far side, driving the lane, passes it right to Mallory, and another turnover for the Pirates. Mallory, there's a shot by Watson, and he is starting to heat up. Watson, a big three-pointer. Tristan Watson has got 12 points for the Lions. Largest lead of the game for Reed State, 29 to 25. Let's go over to Wilcher. Marsh, near side. Shot clock at 10. Marsh, spinning. Wilcher fires a three. No good. And a nice put back and couldn't finish was Tim James and Mallory all the way to the rack. No good. There's the miss dunk by Robinson. Back to CVCC. Back over to James. Oh, a nice pass. Pump fake. Puts up a shot. Rattles in. Ashton Crawford gets on the board. It's a two-point game for the Lions. Mallory. And, uh, oh, he missed a point blank range, and there is a partially block, but Robinson comes up with it. He's got five points. It's a four-point lead for the Lions. CVCC 4-2 and two in the division. Reed State 2-3. and three. This is a very important division game. Marsh. Spin move. Marsh trying to split the defenders. We're going to get a foul on the floor. That's going to reset the shot clock. 3.18 left to go here in the half. The Lions out of Reed State coming into this game. 5-11 and 11 overall, 2-3 and three in division play as Marsh is going to inbounds it underneath the basket. CVCC has got to get a big bucket here. Kind of lost some momentum. Here we go. Crawford, baseline. Nice bounce pass to Marsh. Marsh lost it, but it's going to be another foul by the Lions. And depending on how many shooting fouls they have, that is going to be the sixth team foul. Remember, one more and they'll be in the bonus. As coming into the game for Reed State is going to be number two, Jaclarlin Dennis. Marsh trying to look for his teammate. Gives it over to James. Top of the key. Bounce pass to Marsh. Marsh being guarded by Dennis. Marsh, fadeaway jumper. No good, but a putback. Couldn't finish James. Oh, and a turnover by Crawford. And then another turnover. Sloppy play by both teams. Wiggins with it. Bounce pass. Dennis for three. Dennis hits the three. And this is the largest lead of the game for the Lions. An incredible job by Reed State. Really finishing in transition and just knocking down their shots. That's been the key here in the first half. There's a shot. No good. That's swiped out of bounds. And that's off a of Pirate. 
That's going to be Reed State ball. The Lions, they are up by seven. Largest lead of the game, and they have a chance to extend this lead and close out the first half. Back over to Wiggins, bounce pass, Kid, Dennis swinging around, Wiggins looking for the screen. Shot clock at 13. Dennis coming off the bench. He made that big shot. Four seconds. Kid rushes a shot. No good. Pulling down that rebound is Robinson. Dennis fake. And that is stolen by Colonel Marsh. Here comes a fast break. CVCC alley-oop to James. He catches it and then loses it. But we're going to get a foul. And I believe that's going to be the seventh team foul, which will put CVCC in the bonus. And going to the line for the Pirates is going to be Andrew McKind. As the Pirates have got to find a way to get back into this game. The Lions have gone on a run here. McKind misses the one on one, but there's the offensive rebound by the Pirates. Marsh, double team. There's Hamilton for three. Amari Hamilton. He's got 11 points. And that is how the Pirates try to get back into this game. They're down by four. There's a little fadeaway. No good. That's ripped down by McCain. The shot was attempted by TJ Wright. There's Amari Hamilton for another three. He's heating up. Amari uh, Hamilton, he has got 14 points. It's a one-point lead for the Lions. 6-0 run. Nice bounce pass to Robinson, but good job by Marsh getting the hand in there. Uh, I think the ref, they're going to call a foul on Marsh. It's only their fourth team foul. 57 seconds left to go, 20 on the shot clock. The Pirates down by one. Richard Holdridge, Toygar, George Alabama Sports Live. Happy to be back here on the campus of CVCC. Long pass over to TJ Wright. Back out to Dennis. Swedes it over to Wiggins. Dennis thought about the three. Back to Wiggins. Ten on the shot clock. Wiggins. He's got to get a shot off. Top of the key, no good. Rebounded by Marsh. There's a difference, 33 seconds. Shot clock, game clock. It's Marsh trying to give the Pirates the lead here to end the first half. Over to the boss man. Inside, James. Oh, a nice pass inside to Andrew McKind. And CVCC retakes the lead. That's how you play smart, fundamental basketball. Nine seconds. Wiggins. Shot. No good. Rebounded by Robinson. Up. No good. He's trying to save it. Marsh. Point nine seconds. It's going to stay right here with the Lions. That's enough time to get a catch and shoot. They're down by one. Both teams playing hard to close out this first half. Wiggins will inbounds it. Passes, tipped, and that is how the first half ends. Chattahoochee Valley Community College comes all the way back. It takes a one-point lead in the first half. We got one more half to go. We'd like to thank our sponsors here on the show. Superior Roofing, Rocket Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm Carroll Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Behringer Construction, St. Ann Pacelli, p and Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and Double Coverage. We'll be back with the second half. CVCC up by one here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live.
shot clock doesn't work. So they have to count it like 10 seconds, then start to 20. Oh. So every time you see 20, it stays there. It'll stay there, yeah. yeah.
Welcome back to the campus of CVCC here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Halftime, the Pirates leading the Lions 35-34. to The leading scorer for the Lions is Tristan Watson, who has 12 points. Leading scorer for the Pirates is Amari Hamilton, who has 14 points. As the Pirates trying to snap a two-game losing streak, as last Thursday they lost to Sneed State 80-75, to they were able to battle all the way back and uh, almost came out with the victory. The Lions will get the ball first. Mallory back over to Wiggins. Pass over to Robinson. Oh, and that's swatted away. Great job on the big stuff by Ashton Crawford. That's actually number 12, Amari Hamilton, with a block with a block there. Yeah, all five starters in for the Pirates. Hamilton, quick double team back over to Marsh. Baseline jumper, no good. That's rebounded by Micah Hoover with a put back up and in. It's a three-point lead for the Pirates. Back over to Watson. Watson's got four threes in this game. That's the guy you got to defend behind the arc. Oh, no look, pass all the way, and that is blocked. Looked like it went in, but that was definitely a block. There's London Williams back over to Marsh. Bounce pass to London Williams, known as the boss man. Puts up a shot, no good. Rebounded by Micah Hoover. He puts it up and in. Micah Hoover, four points in this second half. It's a five-point lead. The Pirates coming out strong here in the second half. Mallory back over to Wiggins. Wiggins lost his step. Handles back over to Tim James. For the jam! Throw it down. Tim James Jr. in a timeout by the Lions. We'll take one, two. 18-31 left to go here in the game as it's a seven-point lead for the Pirates here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. You want to talk about halftime adjustments. That is how you respond. 6 nothing to start the second half by Coach Bird and his Pirates trying to snap a two-game losing streak. And uh, really have some position in the division. You got Beaville State at 3-2, and two, Marion Military at 2-3, and three, Reed State at 2-3, and three, Lorene B. Wallace. That's the opponent they're going to play next on Thursday, next Thursday. So this is a very important division game as they can try to lock second place. Still two games behind Sneed State. Here comes a little screen. That was too much for Robinson. Gives it out, puts up a shot, and a floater is made by Kidd. And it's 41 to 36. As the Lions snap a 6-0 scoring run. The pass, and that was anticipated perfectly by Wiggins. It's a two-on-two. Two. Wiggins all the way to the rack, up and in. Wiggins has got nine. It's 41-38. to 38. As CVCC trying to go fast, that was a little too much for Micah Hoover, and it's going to go back to the Lions. Coach Bird, Bird is just saying set, set the tempo. No sloppy play. But the Pirates have got to get a stop here. This is a huge division game in the Alabama Community College Conference. Inside of Robinson. Robinson, oh, swatted away by Hamilton. Amari Hamilton came out of nowhere and just swatted that one out of here. Reed State's going to inbounds underneath the basket. 41 to 38 here in the second half. George Alabama Sports Live, Richard Holdridge here. Please like the Facebook page, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Back over to Mallory, driving the lane. Mallory, swinging it around. There's Watson for three. Oh, he's got a nice touch. 
That is a great shot by Tristan Watson. He's got 15 points, five threes, ties the game. He's got a one of those just arcing shots, catch and shoot. Amari Hamilton puts up a shot, no good. Rebound of my kid. And it's stolen. Colonel Marsh all the way to the rack and misses the dunk. Yeah, you got to gotta do the layup there. Got to get the two points. Right to Robinson. Back out for three. Kid, no good. Rebounded by James. James back over to Marsh. Hamilton, one of the top scorers in the ACCC. Averages over 21 points a game. He's got 14 in this game. Oh, a nice steal. And that is going to be all the way to the rack for Wiggins. And a two-point lead for Reed State. Timeout. CVCC. We want to thank our sponsors. Superior Roofing. Rocket Stone LLC. Mike and S Barbecue. Happy Hour Bar and Grill. State Farm. Carol Purdue. Terry Johnson Agency. Master Wall Incorporated. Barringer Construction. Pacelli. p and Broadcasting. Sports Visions. And Double Coverage. Don't forget, Thread Barringer and I will be... At that school on the hill tomorrow, Carver taking on Monroe. And then on Saturday, we got Shaw taking on Harris County. As Rick Beach from Kutsu Sports is going to be on the broadcast as well. 15-54 left to go in the game as Reed State leading CVCC by two. We'll be back here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Fifteen fifty-four left to go here in the game. At CVCC, they jumped out to that six-point lead, and they just haven't quite put away the Lions. They have found a way to come back, and mainly it's because of Tristan Watson's three-pointing capabilities. Hamilton trying to split the defenders, puts up a shot, gets his own rebound. Hamilton trying to put it back up. And we're going to get a jump ball. It'll be the first jump ball of the game. The possession arrow will stay right here with the Pirates. He's taking this will be Wilcher. Back over to Hamilton. Nice pass to James inside, and that's good. 43 all here. Good pass by Hamilton. James ties it up. Once again, just the back and forth we go. The lead changes from both teams. Can't quite get separation. Kid back out to Mallory, top of the key. He's going to drive, being guarded by Hoover. Oh, he's looking for the shooter. Watson steps up, steps up a screen. James puts up a little floater, air mails it. Shot clock violation. It's going to go back to CVCC with a chance to take the lead with 15.03 left to go here in this game. Don't forget, next week, both the Pirates and Lady Pirates will take on Lorene B. Wallace Community College. As we wind down the regular season, we get into conference play. Oh, a nice pass to the boss man. Up, no good. He couldn't finish, but he does get fouled. So London Williams will go to the line for two with a chance for CVCC to regain the lead. Please like the Facebook page, subscribe to the YouTube channel as uh, we have just incredible content all season long. Williams' first foul shot, no good. We are live on the campus of Chattahoochee Valley Community College in Phoenix City, Alabama, Richard Holdridge, Toy Gar, Georgia Alabama Sports Live. One point lead by CVCC as Williams makes one of two. Back over to Mallory. Mallory, top of the key. Watson fires a three. He cannot miss. Tristan Watson has got 18.6 threes. 
I don't believe he has missed a three-pointer. That, that, is, that is like Kyle Korver-esque. Just a credible shot and just able to get the three and it's back to a two-point lead. All the way to Robinson and good. 5-0 run for Reed State. And it's tied. Nice pass. James. Oh, and a block by Robinson. They're going to call a foul. Robinson's like, huh? I don't know. I think I got all ball. But Tim James Jr. is going to go the line once again, trying to retake the lead for the Pirates. As I'm on the Alabama Community College Conference website, I'm getting excited about CVCC baseball and softball as we got the schedules up on here as well as James makes the first. We got about a month left to go in the regular season for basketball. February is always a great month when you get the end of basketball and the start of baseball and both going on at the same time. Love it. James makes them both. It's a two-point lead for the Pirates. That was huge. 48-46. Here comes Reed State. Kid. Back over to Wiggins. Wiggins, he's looking for the shooter. Don't want to leave Watson open, but there's a three-pointer rattles in and out by Mallory. It's going to be rebounded by Tim James, Jr., CVCC with a chance to extend this lead. Here comes Colonel Marsh. Back over to the boss man. Marsh, top of the key. 16 on the shot clock. James. Oh, got it. Oh, a nice no-look pass over to Marsh. Seven seconds. Nice pass. London Williams. Oh, and he got blocked by Robinson from behind. That was a clean block. But it's going to stay right here with three seconds left to go on the shot clock. Pirates will try to get a shot with 13-12 left to go here in this game. There's a shot. Missed it. One. And no good. Shot clock violation. That hit the edge of the rim. And Reed State's going to get it back. So next home game, next Thursday, the Pirates and Lady Pirates taking on Lorene B. Wallace Community College. Right back here on the campus of CVCC. Comes Mallory. Timeout on the floor. We're going to get another sub in for the Lions. It's going to be TJ Wright coming into the game for Mallory. There's right, baseline. Wiggins. Wiggins lost his step, but back out to right. Mid range jumper, no good. And I think that is going to be off of CVCC, and it's going to be Lions ball. Huge possession here. This has been a back and forth game all day. Back out to Kidd. Nail on Kidd. Over to Wiggins. Top of the key. Ten on the shot clock. Over to Watson. Watson, mid-range jumper, and that's in. Well, that's his first two-pointer. Watson's got 20 points. It's a four-point lead for Reed State. Inside, Hamilton puts it up and in, and that was a big bucket by Amari Hamilton, who's got 16 points. Timeout on the floor. We'd like to thank our sponsors, Superior Roofing, Rocket Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Behringer Construction, Pacelli, PB Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and Double Coverage, Reed State up by two with 12.02 left to go here in this game on the Pirates on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. We'll be
Welcome back to the campus of Chattahoochee Valley Community College. Georgia Alabama Sports Live, Richard Holders, Toy Gar Isla. The Lions from Reed State up by two and with the ball. Facing the Chattahoochee Valley Community College Pirates in this division game. The Lions are in fifth place right now. The Pirates are in second place. Trying to snap a two-game losing streak. There's Wiggins. There's Watson in the corner, and that rattles in and out. I believe that's his first miss. Smith up no good. Uh, I knew he was going to eventually miss one. There's Hamilton, leading scorer for the Pirates. Hamilton thought about it, driving the baseline, goes up, and that is in. Amari uh, Hamilton with 18 points, and when you need a big bucket, Hamilton has been the go-to guy, and he ties this game. Wiggins, oh, kick ball. He'll stay right here with Reed State. Reed State Technical College out of Evergreen, Alabama. About, about an hour out of sight of Montgomery. Back over to Kidd. Top of the key. Good defense. Watson back to Kidd. They're just swinging it around. Wiggins, seven on the shot clock. Wiggins, five. He's got to hurry. Kidd, he's just going to have to fire up a long shot. No good. And Oh, they did not box out. And T.J. Smith, he misses a point-blank range mid-jumper. Huge break for CVCC. Here comes Colonel Marsh. Hamilton. In the corner, Tim James Jr. for three. Three-point lead for the Pirates. That was huge. The Pirates are on a 7-0 run. Wiggins. Oh, Watson's going to fire three. No good. He's missed his last two, three shots. And then Robinson puts up a shot. No good. We might get it over and back as that ball was just delayed on the top of the cylinder, trying to go up for the rebound. They're going to call a foul on London Williams. 10-10, left to go here in the game. 53-50. CVCC on top over Reed State in this crucial division game. Back out to Robinson. Oh, that got tipped. I thought Watson was going to catch and shoot. He's got 20 points inside and a turnover. As that was swatted away by Amari Hamilton. Here comes London Williams. London Williams. Tim James driving the baseline. Kicks it back out. Amari Hamilton for three. 21 points for Amari Hamilton. His season average. And there's a <laughs> that's a kick that's a very loud and boisterous kick by Tim James Jr. 56 to 50. You can hear that basketball hit his knee. Here comes Mallory, the floor general for this Lions team, trying to lead his team back. Looking for Wiggins. Back out to Mallory. Inside to Watson, nice pass. Watson puts it up and in. Well, Tristan Watson is showing he's got some mid-range game to not only his three-point arsenal, it's a four-point lead for CVCC. Back out to Williams, quick double team. Inside, oh, and he lost it. Wiggins with the steal. Two on two fast break all the way to the rack, and Kidd is gonna go to the line for two. Just when CVCC Gets a big lead, and a six-point lead is a big lead on, on a Reed State team that's very talented. Reed State finds a way to call back into the game. They haven't quite put the Lions away. But this really has been a back-and-forth game between both teams. James makes the first. Please like the Facebook page, subscribe to the YouTube channel, George Alabama Sports Live. We will be at Carver tomorrow for Carver Monroe. And one of two missed by Kidd. 56 to 53. Here comes Colonel Marsh. Back over to the boss man for three. Yes! There you go. And you know what? He had nothing but the bottom of the net.
Edie followed through with a shot, too. Back to a six-point lead for the Pirates. Oh, almost lost it. Watts, Wiggins, out of bounds. Turnover back to the Pirates. Leading score for the Pirates, Omari Hamilton with 21. Tim James Jr. has got nine, and London Williams has got eight. There's London Williams for three. No good, but it's rebounded by Micah Hoover trying to save it. And it looks like it was on the line before he can try to deflect it off a Lions player. So Reed State is going to get it back with 8.19 left to go. 59 to 53, the Pirates on top. Mallory takes it across the timeline over to Wiggins, far side. Wiggins has got 11 points. Mallory. And we got a traveling violation on Mallory. It's going to go back to the Pirates. Timeout on the floor. We'll take one, two. 8.06 left to go. CVCC is leading Reed State 59 to 53 here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Welcome back to CVCC. 59 to 53, the Pirates are on top. Here comes Colonel Marsh. Getting the screen by Micah Hoover. Marsh out to London Williams for three. There you go, 11 points. He has got two three-pointers in the second half. Largest lead of the game for the Pirates, 62 to 53. Oh, I almost got a turnover by Mallory. Got away with a double dribble. Kid thought about the three. Wiggins driving the baseline, swings it back out to Mallory for three. No good. Tip drills. Watson gets it. And Watson with the catch and shoot jumper. And Watson has got 24 points. It's 62 to 55. 714 left to go here in the game. Elijah Marsh trying to split the defenders. There's a three-pointer by Amari Hamilton. Front of the iron, no good. Tipped, rebounded by Marsh. Marsh takes it out across the three-point arc. Screened by Williams. Marsh trying to drive the lane. Nice pass to Colonel, Mar Colonel Marsh to London Williams, and Williams will go to the line for two. Good teamwork by Colonel Marsh and the boss man. We are going to get a timeout here, and we'd like to thank our sponsors here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Superior Roofing, Rocket Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Masterwall Incorporated, Behringer Construction, Pacelli, PB Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and double coverage, 654 left to go. CVCC on top of Reed State, 62 to 55. We'll be back here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live.
6.54 left to go as CVCC leading Reed State 62-55. to Trying to snap a two-game losing streak and to hold on to second place in the division. They suffered a five-point loss to Sneed State last Thursday. Sneed State still undefeated in the division. Here's Williams. He makes the first. It's back to an eight-point lead. And no good. Rebounded by Robinson. He makes one of two. Wiggins takes it across the timeline. Being guarded by James. Back out to Kidd. Williams. Swings over to Watson. Watson is just going to catch and shoot. But eventually you're going to miss him. But Mallory with the offensive rebound and the tip back. It's 63-57. to 57. I tell you, Tristan Watson was heating up, and then he has missed the last four shots, and that is rattles in by Elijah Marsh. He answers with a quick bucket at 65 to 57. 612 left to go. There's a three-pointer by Mallory. Tyler Mallory, the leading scorer on the team. He's had a quiet game. He's got seven points, and it's a five-point lead for CVCC. Here comes Marsh. Marsh thought about the three. Being defended by Robinson. Inside to Williams. Shot clock at 10. Williams puts it up. Blocked by Robinson. And Mallory comes up with a steal. Mallory puts up a floater. No good. That is going to be rebounded. Oh, it, I think we're going to get a, yeah, jump ball. That was rebounded by McKind. Coming in there to try to rip it away was Mallory, and that jump ball is going to stay right here with the Lions. 5.32 left to go as CVCC leading by five. Here's Robinson putting up a shot as Wiggins and one. Count the bucket. What a shot. TJ Wiggins has got a chance to cut the Pirates' lead to two. Reed State just won't go away. Here comes T.J. Wiggins to the line for the add one. Oh, you can hear a pin drop in this chip. It's 65 to 63. Marsh. CVCC needs to get a big bucket here. Williams back over to Marsh. That's stolen by Kidd. Kidd can tie it right here with a jam, and he does. 65 to 65 with 5.05 left to go here in this game. Williams inside of James, and we're going to have a foul. That's going to be on Mallory. It's only the fourth team foul for the Lions. 4.59 left to go. 65-65 here in this important Alabama Community College Conference matchup. Oh, a nice spin move by James, but he lost the handles. Wiggins with the steal, and that's going to be a clear path foul. Not sure if that's going to be a technical, if they're going to call it. But Amari Hamilton had no choice but to Get in there and get the foul after the steal by Wiggins. As Reed State comes into this game, five and ten overall. They are two and three in the division. Tied with Loreen B. Wallace, Marion Military Institute. Here comes Mallory. Too much mustard for Robinson. It's going to go back to CVCC. And they have a chance to take the lead once again. Largest lead of the game for the Pirates was nine. And a Reed State might have had a four-point lead at one time. There's a go. Tim James in the corner for three. 
Huge three by Tim James Jr. It's 68 to 65. He's got 12 points. Back out to Wiggins. Watson back to Wiggins. Over to Mallory. Can he answer? Mallory, quick double team, throws it out to Wiggins. Wiggins driving the baseline, puts up a reverse layup and good. He had to change the trajectory of his shot to get it down. It's a one point lead for the Pirates. 3.57 left to go. Marsh driving the lane. Oh, that's pass over to Williams. Williams puts it up. No good, rebounded by Watson, huge rebound. Reed State can take the lead. Almost stolen by Amari Hamilton. He had to catch himself, lost his balance. 3.42 left to go. The Pirates up by one. As we have got another timeout on the floor, we'd like to thank our sponsor, Superior Roofing, Rock and Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Barringer Construction, Pacelli, PB Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and Double Coverage. 3.42 left to go. CVCC up by one on Reed State here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Three forty-two left to go here in this game. The CVCC Pirates leading the Lions of Reed State by one, sixty-eight to sixty-seven. Richard Holdridge, Toygar Isla, George Alabama Sports Live. Please like the Facebook page and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Inbounding the pass is going to be Wiggins. He's looking for somebody. He's got to be careful. He doesn't get a five-second violation. Watson, back over to Wiggins. Wiggins over to Mallory. The Lions can take the lead with a basket here. There's Watson, he's the catch and shoot guy. Back over to Mallory, five on the shot clock. Mallory thought about passing it. Robinson up and good, and he'll go the line for the and one. And he is pumped up about that one. It looked like Mallory wanted to shoot. The shot clock was winding down. He passed it instead. I think the Pirates were anticipating that Jadavian Robinson was going to sh to uh, get collect the pass, but he actually puts up the shot. The lines are up by one, and he airmails the foul shot there. 3.20 left to go, and Reed stayed up by one now. This is a huge possession for the Pirates. You got your starters in there. Amari Hamilton, Tim James, Micah Hoover. You also have Wilcher and Colonel Marsh. Marsh open lane all the way to the rack and in. A big bucket for Elijah Marsh, 70 to 69. The Pirates on top with three minutes left to go. Mallory. Swing pass, almost stolen by Marsh, but we're going to get a foul. Every possession from here on out will be crucial for both teams. CVCC wants to get a little bit of separation in the division, try to go up to a 5-2 to two record because right now Reed State at 2-3. and three. The margin of error, especially in this division, is crucial. Wiggins looking for Mallory, 18 on the shot clock. Mallory trying to get by James. Back out to Wiggins. They're in the zone defense for the Pirates. 
James Wiggins bounce pass. Robinson puts up a shot up and in. And Reed State retakes the lead. Robinson has had some huge buckets in the second half. It's 71 to 70 with 227 left to go here in the game. Elijah Marsh over to James. Or Hamill, or that's actually uh, Wiltshire. Back out to James. Inside. Hamilton putting up a shot. Amari Hamilton. Kick ball, trying to get it. Staying with it is Wiggins right there to Mallory. Oh, and a block. Huge block by Marsh. Wiggins inside to Robinson. Robinson goes up. No good, but he will go to the line for two. 156 left to go. Reed State up by one. And Jadavian Robinson coming into this game, averaging 11 points a game off the bench, is going to go the line for two to try to extend this Lions lead. And he misses the first. Huge miss. Don't forget the next game will be next Thursday against Lorene B. Wallace Community College. The Lady Pirates and Pirates will both be in action right here on the campus of CVCC. Robinson off the glass, no good, but what an offensive rebound by Watson. But Watson is going to get tied up, and it's going to be a foul. But we're going to get a timeout with 150 left to go. Reed State leading CVCC by one. We want to thank our sponsor, Superior Roofing, Rocket Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Barringer Construction, St. Ann Pacelli, PNB Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and Double Coverage. So the leading scorer for Reed State is Tristan Watson. He's got 24 points. Amari Hamilton leading the way for CVCC with 21 points. 150 left to go. The Lions leading the Pirates by one here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. One fifty left to go. Reed State leading CVCC by one. This has been an incredible back and forth game by both teams as they know what's at stake as placement in Division Two as we head into the playoffs about a month away. Chattahoochee Valley is four and two on the season in the division. Reed State is two and three. Inbounds it is going to be Robinson. Over to Wiggins. Inside to Robinson. It's guarded by the boss man. Back out to Mallory. Over to Kidd. Inside to Watson. Nine on the shot clock. Wiggins. Good defense. Oh, and that's going to be a foul on CVCC. Going to the line is going to be TJ Wiggins. 135 left to go here in this game. George Alabama Sports Live. Please like the Facebook page. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thrip Aaron and I will be at Carver tomorrow for Carver Monroe. A huge region game for both the Carver Tigers and Lady Tigers. Wiggins' first foul shot is good. It's a two-point lead for the Lions. And then on Saturday, we got ourselves a treat. We got Shaw and Harris County. Get to see Rick Beach once again from Kutsu Sports. And he misses the second. So CVCC can tie with a basket. 72 to 70, there's a three point shot and it's good! What a shot by number 11, Amari Wilcher. And 
CVCC with a one-point lead. Yeah, that foul shot was huge that he missed it. 124 left to go. The Pirates leading the Lions by one. We'll be right back. You don't want to go anywhere, folks, as we got one that's going to go down to the wire here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. One twenty-four left to go in this game. The Pirates with a one-point lead, trying to snap a two-game losing streak. Georgia Alabama Sports Live, Richard Holdridge, Toygar Isla. This has been an incredible game. And both teams know how huge this game is. Here come the Lions, Mallory. Going to take it across the timeline with 122 left to go. Wiggins back to Mallory. Got to watch out for the shooter, Watson. Although he has missed a couple of threes. Here comes Mallory driving the lane. Out to Kidd for three and rattles in and out. Rebounded by the boss man. Huge rebound by London Williams. One minute to go. The Pirates with the ball and the lead. Remember, there is a shot clock. 15 seconds. Oh, a nice pass over to James. James, Marsh, back out to Hamilton. Hamilton, Euro step, puts up a shot. No good. Rebounded by Watson. 36 seconds left to go. Watson over to Wiggins. 31 seconds. And we got to collide. They're not going to call anything. There's a three pointer by Mallory. No good. And that is going to be tipped, rebounded by timeout. That's Hamilton with the rebound. No, that is number 22 with the rebound. And Ashton Crawford, we're going to take a break here. 19 seconds left to go. Pirates up by one here at Georgia Alabama Sports Live. All right, so that was Amari Hamilton getting up. I mean, we we didn't we didn't know what was happening there, but he looks like he's fine. The Pirates with the ball, up by one, 19.6 seconds left to go, and they're in a timeout. We want to thank our sponsors, Superior Roofing, Rocket Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Barringer Construction, Pacelli, PB Broadcasting. Sports Visions and double coverage. Don't go anywhere. Looks like this is going to come down to the wire as CVCC leads by one over Reed State. Georgia, Alabama Sports Live. This is what we live for on the broadcast. Games that just come down to the end. But with 19 seconds left to go, and I believe they did reset the shot clock, Reed State's going to have to foul. Put the Pirates on the line. Yeah, there is no shot clock right now with 19.6 seconds. London Williams, known as the boss man. Big shout out to Robert Edmonds for that. Over to Marsh. Marsh, and they finally foul him. Kid with the foul. And Colonel Marsh will go the line to try to extend this lead with 17.3 seconds left to go. 
Please like our Facebook page and subscribe to the YouTube channel. We got a couple more games later this week. Thrip Berenger and Noah Shelton did Springwood and Glenwood on Tuesday. We've got Carver and Monroe on Friday. Saturday, we've got Harris County and Shaw. It'll be the first time that we make our trip up to Harris County. Once again, we would like to thank our sponsors, Superior Roofing, Rocket Stone LLC, Mike and Ed's Barbecue, Happy Hour Bar and Grill, State Farm, Carol Purdue, Terry Johnson Agency, Master Wall Incorporated, Barringer Construction, St. Ampicelli, PME Broadcasting, Sports Visions, and Double Coverage. 17.3 seconds left to go. And CVCC up by one with a chance to extend this lead even more. So if Marsh makes both, then Reed State has to tie with a three. And they they have probably the the ultimate arsenal when it comes to three-point shooting. Tristan Watson has been on fire as he has shot six threes today in this game. London Williams will inbounds it. Oh, and he lost it. Trying to get it back, and, and that's a turnover. Kid coming up with it. 14 seconds with it. Wiggins, 10 seconds. Back out to Smith. Timeout. That was a huge turnover by CVCC with 8.2 seconds left to go. So they have got to get a defensive stop. As Coach Bird is going to call a timeout, they've got to draw something up. They were just trying to go for the inbounds, but it was off the mark, and Reed State was able to come up with it. And the way they were going fast, it looks like they were trying to get a quick bucket. But if any time that you need a defensive stop, it's right now with 8.2 seconds left to go. We'll be right back here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. You don't want to go anywhere. Welcome back to CVCC. Richard Holders, Georgia Alabama Sports Live. 8.2 seconds left to go. The Pirates leading by one over Reed State. But the Lions from Reed State have the ball. They could try to win it with a game-winning shot. But this is where the Pirates need to come up with a big defensive stop. You don't want to foul them either because you're up by one. Wiggins will inbounds it. Over to Mallory, six seconds. Mallory driving, passes it to Kidd. Kidd, Mallory puts up a shot. No good. And the Pirates win the game by one. That was a defensive stop that CVCC needed in a big clutch moment. They win the game 73 to 72. And Amari Hamilton with 21 points is the player of the game. Chattahoochee Valley pushes their record to 14 and 6, 5 and 2 in the division. And they will take on Loreen B. Wallace Community College right back here on the campus of CVCC. But before then, they'll also go on the road as well. We're going to go and take a break and we're going to get Coach Bird for an interview here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. Once again, the Pirates. Win this one by one over the Lions. We'll be right back.
All right, welcome back to CVCC. Wow, what a game. 73 to 72, CVCC wins over Reed State. I'm here with the head basketball coach, Coach Douglas Bird. Coach, what a game. Well, I, I told the guys, the rest of the year, these are conference games. It doesn't matter if you're at home or if you're in the way. They're going to be dog fights, and they're going to go down to the last possession. Who will be able to, to make the last stop? And um, we were able to make the last stop. We did a really good job, I thought, defensively on that last possession. I actually thought that was a great defensive sequence. With eight seconds, they had a chance to win the game with a shot. But your defense just came up clutch. But it was clutch buckets by Omari Hamilton. I mean, Watson, the shooter for Reed State, he shot six threes. And he really kept Reed State in this game. You couldn't quite put them away. And Reed State just clawed their way back. And it was just a back and forth game. And, and, and a huge division game, too. This puts you at five and two and uh, all alone in second place. Yes, it does. Uh, um, I told them, Reed State, you can't look at their record, but they have been battle tested. They have been down in um, the panhandle playing uh, Pinnacle, uh, 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 Chipola um, uh, and all the other rest teams that are down there in, in the panhandle uh, district in, in Florida. And so they are battle tested and their record just didn't show it. I told our team when we're doing our scouting report that this is this was going to be a, a tough match. And um, like you said, we went up nine, I think, and they just kept clawing back. We just couldn't put them away. And again, uh, conference game um, are tough. And, and we're thankful that we were able to uh, hold um, home court and, and pull out a win. Absolutely. Good luck the rest of the way. We look forward to seeing you guys back here next Thursday. And as we wind down this season, we gear up for the playoffs. Yes, we do. Um, one game at a time. <laughs> Oh, yeah. we, 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 we're not thinking about uh, what's behind us and what in, this is the first game in front of us. Um, and we're ready. Um, we're going on the road, uh, our next contest. And so that's make it even tougher being on the road and being a conference game as well. So, you know, we, we're going to take some rest on tomorrow and then we're going to get back at it on Saturday and Sunday and uh, put some work together. We go to uh, Wallace Selma and uh, looking forward to, to pulling out a win there. Congratulations, Coach. Thank you. All right, that is the head basketball coach of the CVCC Pirates, Coach Douglas Bird. Thank you so much for everybody for watching another game here on Georgia Alabama Sports Live. I want to thank my producer, Toy Gar Isla, for making this broadcast possible. Don't forget, we are going to be on that school on the hill. Thrip Barron and I will be on the campus of Carver as we will have Carver and Monroe. And then on Saturday, Rick Beach and myself will be Shaw at Harris County. Thank you, everybody, for watching again and have a great rest of your night.